वेलकम टू एम पी एस मोटिवेटर्स अनिक ऑनलाइन टीचिंग एंड लर्निंग प्लेटफॉर्म आई एम जैनेन्द्र कुमार स्टैंडिंग इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू बिफोर स्टार्टिंग माई दिस सेशन आई वुड लाइक टू विश यू ऑल अ वेरी वेरी ग्रेस गुड मॉर्निंग सो गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स एंड इन दिस सेशन आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस विथ यू इम्फैटिक विथ डू डज डिड फ्रेंड्स इम्फैटिक मीन्स जोरदार we all know that do and does are used in simple present tense and did is used in simple past tense as helping verbs in the formation of negative and interrogative sentences but do does and did are also used to make emphatic sentences let us learn how to use do and does friends here you can see that and we can see that the structure formula subject plus v1 oblique v5 plus object oblique other word is written on the board and we all know that this formula is used in simple present tense this is the first structure formula of simple present tense and this formula is used to make affirmative sentences this has been taught to all the students in previous sessions when tense was taught but once again i am memorizing this topic i play cricket we all know that i is the first person singular number and with first person singular number we use v1 that is also known as the first form of 2 plus v1 it is the first form of an action verb and it is also supposed to be in plural number v1 is plural form of an action verb we often make this type of mistakes at the time of saying that v1 is in plural form we are just habituate to say v1 is singular form but it is wrong to say v1 is not in singular form but it is in plural form it is just opposite the formation of plural form or uh, and singular of nouns when nouns are in singular form and we add s or es to them we change them into plural form but when verbs of the first form are added with s or es we change them into singular form and this is the first form of verb to play so play is in plural form and now we have to learn how to make it emphatic and why do we make emphatic we have also to know why we make emphatic for example if anybody says i play cricket and others say no you don't play cricket then we say the same thing rigorously we say the same thing by putting emphasis on the statement and we say i do play cricket i do play cricket here i play cricket means mai cricket khelta hu and I do play cricket means मैं क्रिकेट खेलता ही तो हूँ We generally say I play cricket, but when anybody says no, you don't play cricket, in spite that I play cricket, I say I do play cricket by putting emphasis on the statement. अर्थात यदि मैं कहता हूँ कि मैं क्रिकेट खेलता हूँ और दूसरे लोग कहते हैं कि नहीं आप क्रिकेट नहीं खेलते हैं तो अपने स्टेटमेंट को जोरदार बनाने के लिए अपने कथन को जोरदार बनाने के लिए मैं पुनः कहता हूं आई डू प्ले क्रिकेट मैं क्रिकेट खेलता ही तो हूं आई हैव अगेन टेकन वन सेंटेंस ही प्लेज क्रिकेट द नेक्स्ट एग्जाम्पल इज ही प्लेज क्रिकेट इट मीन्स वह क्रिकेट खेलता है and here the fifth form of the verb to play and 
place is the singular form we often make mistakes at the time of saying that place is a singular form we are habituated to say place is a plural form but place is not a plural form place is a singular form here in the first example i is also the singular subject but a plural verb has been used with it it happens in simple present tense and here he is singular subject and with he singular form verb has been used that is plays woh cricket khelta hai he plays cricket means woh cricket khelta hai and if anybody says no he does not play cricket nahi woh cricket nahi khelta hai then if he plays cricket and anybody else says that he does not play cricket we say the statement rigorously by putting emphasis on it and the emphatic sentence of he plays cricket is he does play cricket woh cricket khelta hi to hai when we use do or does we use v1 so we should not make mistakes after using do or does we have not to use v5 in case of do we often write v1 but i have seen many students faults they use v5 with does also but we have not to make this type of mistakes we have to use v1 after does also so friends i hope you would have understood how to make emphatic of simple present tense how to make emphatic of the sentences in simple present tense using do or does i would like to discuss with you some more examples but before it i would suggest you to take its a screenshot or write down in your notebook friends now i am going to write down a few sentences in simple present tense and then i will write down their emphatic friends here i have written a few sentences in simple present tense i would like to read them to you sita cooks food sita khana banati hai my फ्रेंड्स हेल्प मी मेरे दोस्त गण मेरी सहायता करते हैं हिज फादर सिंग्स अ सॉन्ग उसके पिताजी गाना गाते हैं वी प्ले टेनिस हम लोग टेनिस खेलते हैं नाउ वी हैव टू चेंज देम इन टू इम्फैटिक विथ डू डज फ्रेंड्स हियर वी सी दैट इन द फर्स्ट एग्जाम्पल Sita cooks food V5 cooks has been used with Sita and we have to change this sentence into emphatic with do or does i have already mentioned that wherever v5 is used we have to use does to make emphatic so the emphatic of sita cooks food will be sita does cook food sita khana banati hi to hai in the second example or in the second sentence used as an example v1 help is used with the subject my friends and wherever we see v1 we have to use do to make emphatic my friends do help me it means mere dost gan meri sahayata karte hi to hain the meaning of this sentence is mere dost gan meri sahayata karte hain lekin yadi koi yah kahe ki aapke dost log aapki sahayata nahi karte hain then to oppose and to express our contradiction 
वी से माई फ्रेंड्स डू हेल्प मी कैसे नहीं करते हैं वे लोग मेरी सहायता करते ही तो हैं इट मीन्स टू स्पीक रिगोरसली टू स्पीक अगेंस्ट द रोंग स्टेटमेंट ऑफ एनी वन बी यूज इम्फैटिक सेंटेंसेस यानी विरोध करने के लिए यदि कोई गलत कहे किसी चीज के बारे में तो उसे सही साबित करने के लिए हम लोग इम्फैटिक सेंटेंसेज का प्रयोग करते हैं जोरदार कथनों का प्रयोग करते हैं हिज फादर सिंग्स अ सॉन्ग उसके पिताजी गाना गाते हैं सिंग्स इज अगेन द फिफ्थ फॉर्म ऑफ दर्ब टू सिंग एंड इट्स इम्फैटिक सेंटेंस विल बी मेड बाई यूजिंग डज बिकॉज इट इज भी फाइव सिंग्स इज द फिफ्थ फॉर्म ऑफ द एक्शन फर्ब टू सिंग एंड इट्स इम्फैटिक विल बी मेड बाई यूजिंग डज हिज फादर डज सिंग अ सॉन्ग उसके पिताजी गाना गाते ही तो हैं इन द लास्ट एग्जाम्पल वी प्ले टेनिस द फॉर प्ले इज द फर्स्ट फॉर्म ऑफ टू प्ले एंड वेयर इव हर वी सी द फर्स्ट फॉर्म ऑफ अ भर्ब वी शुड यूज डू टू मेक इट्स इम्फैटिक एंड द इम्फैटिक ऑफ बी प्ले टेनिस विल बी वी डू प्ले टेनिस आई होप यू वुड हैव अंडर स्टूड हाउ टू मेक इम्फैटिक विथ डू डज नाउ इन द नेक्स्ट सेशन आई वुड लाइक टू टीच यू इम्फैटिक विथ डिड बट इन दिस सेशन ऑनली दिस मच and i am meeting you soon in the next session after a short break after a short after a small interval of time till that time you can go on revising this topic and uh, think of questions try to solve questions with books in many books emphatic with do does did is given and you can try to solve them if you have any problem you can ask me to help you through comments if you like my this session i would like to request you to like it comment it and share it to your friends and also download mps motivators by going to play store thank you have a nice day